Welcome to a new episode of Kid Good at Open Rollercoaster Tycoon 2. In the last episode, I showed you how you could make cooler looking paths using Flying Saucer Track or some of the, uh, the bases of some of the other rides. In this episode, I will show you how to do the same but for uh, sloped paths. Because obviously, uh, you cannot make a sloped uh, Flying Saucer uh, Track. So, there's actually uh, two ways that I like to do this. So, first way I like to do this is using the River Rapids track. So, to do this, we'll just create a sloped piece of a River Rapids track, like that. Let's give it a blue color, like the rest of the track there. And just copy the piece and we'll paste it here. And we'll make the footpath invisible. Uh, we'll need to lower the ground a bit, or else it will uh, look quite glitchy. So I'll do that now. And we'll just make the path invisible like that. And we'll lower the track here. There we go. Now we have a set of stairs here that, in my opinion, looks quite good with the flying saucer track. Um, there's another ride we can uh, we can use for this. Uh, that's the splash barge ride. Um, I will not completely rebuild the track, but I will just use the allow arbitrary ride type sheet, and I'll just change it into a splash barge ride. Where is it? Here it is. Right. And this is also a way to make make it look like you're peeps are walking on stairs. Um, the track's actually a bit lower than the River Rapids uh, ride, so if you want to use this you should probably make the track a bit higher. Like that. So when I use this track, uh, this, this uh, the track doesn't have any railings, so if if you want to make railings, you'll have to do it yourself. I like to use uh, steel fences for this. Like this. And then just with some dial inspector magic, we'll slope them. And we'll bring them to the correct height. And we'll do the same on this side. Right, and you could of course also make the railings in the middle if you want. Um, yeah, you can also use this for normal paths. The stairs will usually look uh, look quite well. All right, then there's one last trick that I want to show you. Uh, some of the real world parks, uh, usually in uh, countries in Scandinavia, for example, they like to use uh, escalators. And in this game you can also make pretty good looking escalators. And you do that with the dinghy slide uh, lift hill track. I will just make one here as well. Like that. Let's color them black. And let's just make the footpaths invisible. And of course we want to prevent beeps from walking through here. And of course to make it more realistic, we should make uh, make them, yeah, make the beeps only go in one direction. So now they will they will walk on the upwards on this side, and they will walk downwards on this side. Of course, you can always uh, hide the banners using corrupt elements as well. Of course, this doesn't stop your staff from walking in the wrong direction. But well, you cannot have everything be very realistic. Of course, this escalator will take some more work to make it look nice. But uh, it's a trick that I really like to use. 
Alright everyone, I hope this uh, video was useful uh, to you, and I hope to see you again in the next video. See you later!